In this video, I'm going to talk about mouse utilities function uh, within the Power Toys tool application. A collection of mouse utilities for manipulating mouse pointers, mouse movements, and mouse highlights. Now, what does this mean? Is uh, take for example, if you're presenting your screen, you know. Now, if you want to play around with the mouse pointers, or if you want to highlight some components within your or presentation or it for a matter of fact any of the screen which you're presenting it to the audience then this feature may come handy now what are the features within mouse utilities is find my mouse mouse highlighter mouse jump mouse pointers crosshair now as you see over in the screen that i have highlighted something with the mouse pointer okay so i have activated my shortcut and that's why i'm able to show you this mouse highlighter shortcut Windows Shift H, Mouse Crosshair Shortcut, Windows Alt P, <coughs> and Mouse Jump Shortcut, Windows Shift T. Now here, the in the screenshot, you see this is a crosshair. Okay, so if you want to show a crosshair kind of a interface, then uh, you need to use this shortcut. Mouse Utilities, uh, like if you see here, this is a mouse highlighter shortcut. So here, if you want to show the pointer as a uh, like a circle you know then you can use mouse highlighter shortcut now everything will be clear once i show you in the demo okay so first thing uh let me uh, go into the power toys tool and show you mouse utilities now here there are a couple of things which i want to show you one is like find my mouse highlights the position of the cursor when pressing the control key twice now i have used the method of pressing left control twice you can change the shortcut to right or shake mouse or any of your custom shortcut now see what i'm what happens when i do press uh, left control twice you know the moment i do that you see this big yellow circle right now i can navigate to various section and then this gets highlighted okay and if i press escape the circle goes away so this is find my mouse cursor now appearance and behavior can be controlled through here now the spotlight color is say yellow if i want to make it say red okay now i change it to red and now if i do double control and you see this cursor has changed now i can change the spotlight radius from 100 to maybe let's see what the bigger number we can put let's say 500 okay now see this is how you can uh, manipulate the cursor okay so i'm just gonna revert it to 100 now this is find my mouse second one is mouse highlighter now think about it like if you want to show something in the screen but you you don't want the standard cursor which you see over here in the arrow form if you want to use something called as a highlighter then you press window shift h so if i press window shift h then the highlighter should be shown now uh, this shortcut may not work when you are in a power toy setting interface so let me remember the shortcut window shift h if i press window shift h and now if i uh, let me again go back to this power toy tool and show you window shift h okay so window shift h and if you see this i'm pressing my left mouse button and that's why it is uh, showing the circle around with it right because of this color now similarly if i press a uh, right uh, mouse button and then drag this cursor you see blue color now these all things can be configured from here i can change this color to yellow or green you know and now this takes that precedence and the moment i change this to say blue Okay, and if I press this, then this is how it works. So what I'm doing is uh, for primary button highlight color, it is uh, left right click of the mouse and drag it. Okay, and secondary button highlight color is right mouse button and then drag it. Right, and you can change the radius. I'm not going to go through that, but you can make that changes over here as well. So if you make this as 40, then the circle may uh, circle size may increase. You know, yeah, okay. So let me turn this off first. And now if I go into the next part, this is a mouse jump. Now, see, I can't demonstrate mouse jump over here, but I will explain you the basic concept. 
imagine now this is my screen right now this screen is like on a 15 inch monitor or a 7, 21 inch monitor so this is okay for me i can navigate the screen from one end of the screen to another end of the screen but imagine if you have a very big monitor which is like a say a 19 inch screen okay uh, so then if you want to move a mouse from one point to uh, one location to another it might take a while so you have a shortcut which says window shift d okay so if you do that you can enable that mouse jump so what essentially it does it generates a thumbnail and then you just need to click on the thumbnail so i'll give you an ex i'll show you an example in my screen itself okay so let me uh, the case would be like my mouse pointer would be on the top left and then i want to move the pointer to the bottom right okay now let's activate the shortcut window shift d now i've activated the shortcut the blue window which you see is the thumbnail okay so let's assume my mouse pointer is over here and now my, my, i want to move the mouse pointer somewhere here so if i click over here now see where the mouse pointer resides it's on the bottom right now again i will show you if this is a bigger screen and my mouse pointer is somewhere here and i want to put the mouse pointer somewhere here you know on this say, screen ruler click here and then the mouse pointer is over here so it makes use of the thumbnail to jump your mouse from one point of the screen to another and it can use it you can use it across multiple screens as well next we move on to the mouse pointer crosshairs now mouse pointer crosshair draws the crosshair centered on the mouse pointer so windows alt p so if i put windows alt p you see this as a crosshair intersection right now you can use in combination with the other uh, control which i showed you so you take for example if i uh, include this with find my mouse if i put uh, if i press control twice see what happens now this is also one of the representational way to show uh, or uh, engage your audience by showing uh, them what you want them to see okay so this is how you can show and also uh, you can use it uh, alongside with the highlighter as well so if i press window shift h okay and if i do it like this it works and like this it works okay so i'm using alongside highlighter so it is a combination of crosshair as well as highlighter so let me turn off this crosshair now windows alt p is again we need to type to get out of this so so this is all about mouse uh, utilities uh, it allows you to uh, 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 manipulate the mouse cursor and then point mouse to uh, a location uh, by using this utility in the power toy setting